this video, we show how to produce the graph shown in figure 5.1 on page 169. We follow the instructions given in example 5.1a on page 210. Uh, first, we open a new one-dimensional form. We're going to plot a graph. Uh, we're going to plot it over the interval minus 16 to 16 using 1,024 points, which is our the default anyway. Um, now, previously I uh, created this formula. Uh, that's the uh, uh, first uh, function to graph, and we plot that. Let's see, I think we need to connect by lines. Yes. Now, uh, transform uh, Fourier uh, and uh, we just plot. And there's the graph that's shown in uh, uh, part B of the uh, figure. Uh, see the two spikes here, those are the real parts of the transform, and the blue part spikes here, they're showing the uh, imaginary parts of the transform. Uh, the second graph uh, that we transformed will open up a new window. We'll plot over the same interval, and we used uh, this formula. Uh, would just uh, you could connect it by line segments, uh, but I'll leave that to you. Uh, now we'll transform that, and there's the graph uh, shown in Part D of the figure. Uh, that concludes uh, this video. Thank you for watching.